I recently published a video on calculating days left from the deadline along with color coding and flagging for overdue dates. The color coding can be customized in the cell formatting pop-up window like this. Press Ctrl 1 and you open up format cell and this is where you define the colors. However, there was an interesting question about the possibility of using colors beyond the three options of red, blue, and green. Well, we have a few more options for color and this is how you can define it. The first method is to use a standard color name as shown on the screen with a total of eight options available. If I missed out any other colors, please do let me know in the comment section. I've just changed red to magenta and this is what it looks like. The second option involves utilizing color index or color palettes. By typing the word color followed by a number, you have access to a range of 56 different colors to choose from. I have consolidated all the colors that I have outlined on this video here and this is what each of the color looks like. This first section is the standard color method here. As you can see, I say black here and this is your color index or your color palette. 